She deserves to die. She left us with nothing. Oh my gosh. What just happened? I don't know how much whacking I have to do before it's done. I think we killed Amelia. This may have been a homicide. You guys saw nothing. Hello everyone and welcome back to Spirit Tea. We only have 17 spirits left to find. Look at that. And we only have four more bathhouse upgrades to make. I have completed at least one. I've been busy behind the scenes here. And if you take a look at my money, there's a possibility we might be able to buy a bicycle today, which I'm super happy about because this walking business, it's overrated, I'm telling you. And if you haven't noticed, the fuzz, the popo, are standing outside of our house. We have some new spirit clues, and this is one of them, I believe. Let's see what they want. Is this live PD? I'm investigating a missing persons report. A child named Momo has gone missing. Oh no, that's Song's little baby that she's always wearing on her back. The one that she didn't want me to see running around naked. <laughs> Momo is missing. New to town, hmm, in situations like this. Things don't exactly look too favorable for a stranger who's just moved into a quiet and peaceful town. Okay, so Momo is missing. Clearly we need some more information on this situation. It is also the end of summer. I did hope to catch a yellow jacket before the end of summer, but I don't think that's going to happen. I'm having real trouble with that. And we have some more Popo. Wait, was he eating a donut? Were you eating a donut, sir? He's eating something. Okay. Oi, you. You look rather suspicious. What have you been up to, hey? Move along now. I'm investigating a missing child. Unless you've come to confess. We're not going to find Momo this way, I assume. It's got to be the work of a spirit, right? But Momo is missing. And we have cops everywhere. Let's check the bulletin board. So another clue we have is from Amelia. Amelia is having some problems. Kind of going crazy. A bit of dementia, perhaps. Looking for something I can't quite find. Wait a minute. Looking for something I can't quite... If you find... Place, please let me know. See what I mean? She's not making any sense. We still have Lee's spirit to find. And then we have another one. Ling, the nurse from the school, says, Keep your eyes open for a skeletal presence around town. If spotted, please let me know. I did find a skeleton around town, but I did not talk to it because I didn't want to progress that off video. So we have... Two spirits there to find, and then we have Momo, missing child, last seen at the town shop. If found, please contact the local police, Miko or Amelia. A reward has been offered. So that's three new spirits, and then there's a fourth. A wild boar is spotted in the area. Please be careful and do not pick the yellow mushrooms. What? Wait a minute. I know I've picked something yellow. It was like a yolk cap or something. I've been picking the mushrooms. <laughs> All right, let's go in the shop. It's 8.30 a.m. Oh no, aw, she's crying. I mean, understandably so. Oh, Bunny, I don't know what to do. It's Momo, he's missing. The police are, they're investigating. Oh, my baby. I'm sorry. I'm a mess. I just don't know what could have happened. I told the police everything I could think of. The only thing that was anything out of the ordinary was I heard some strange noises outside the shop the day Momo went missing. That's a clue. Strange noises could be a spirit, but I don't think even spirits would go this far, Bunny. Kidnapping a child, it's unforgivable. But what if Momo went with the spirit 
Is Momo even mobile? Honestly, I don't know. I don't know how old Momo is. Is that the only clue we're gonna get? I was watching a traditional flute performance on TV when I heard the noises. So if it's in blue, it's a clue. Traditional flute? Are we supposed to buy a flute? I don't think she's gonna be able to sell us anything. What? No, I can't even buy anything. Is there a flute somewhere? Is there a flute somewhere that we could steal it? I don't remember seeing a flute in anybody's house either. We'll check in here in Echoes, but I mean, they only sell food. Oh no, what's Bruce doing back here? Bruce. Some of the classes put on a tradition. Oh, oh my gosh. Some of the classes put on a traditional flute performance at the school the other day. It's great to see kids trying their best, but you can really tell which ones just aren't picking it up. The school? I mean, we'll check at Kenzo's. I don't think there's anything. The school. Is there a music room at the school? Wait a minute. What day is it? It's Sunday, but we're going to the school. The only thing I remember is there's a big auditorium, I think, all the way on... Is it this floor? Yeah, right here. <gasps> Shut up. Is this the flute? It just says flute. Is this the flute that we need? It has to be. This wasn't here before. Can we use it? Oh, we can. We can play the flute. All right. Wait a minute. We gotta take this back. <laughs> While we're here, let's go over to the school nurses area and just double check that, oh yeah, <laughs> see, the skeleton is missing. This is Ling's office. So we need to try and find the skeleton, which I think I know where it was. There's too much going on right now. <laughs> let's take this flute back. Hmm. Okay, so maybe this isn't going to help. What if we turn on our spirit vision and play it around the shop? Did you see that? What is that? It's almost like somebody's crying. She said it was around her shop. No, nothing happens here. We're just going to keep playing, I guess. Are these footprints? Maybe? What are those puddles? <gasps> they are. They're leading me this way. On the beach? Yes. Oh, come on. Are these going to lead me to Momo? We're just going to follow them. <gasps> what? <gasps> There's Momo! Are you serious? You two actually kidnapped a baby. Well, 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 look who it is. Our great guardian himself. You see, I told you we shouldn't have done it. Don't apologize to him. He didn't do anything. When us spirits started to lose ourselves, he's supposed to be the one protecting us. But you forgot your duty, didn't you? That's enough. You just sat there day after day, sad that your little speaker friend got sick. So the person who lived in our house, the speaker, the one who could see the spirits, got sick. You're playing a dangerous game. Really, I think you've said enough. So what if some stupid mortal got sick and died? She didn't fulfill her duty and find a successor. Wait, that's me. I'm the successor. And besides, you're supposed to be looking out for spirits, not them. They're nothing. So we have two salty spirits here. They're sad that the speaker who lived in our house died and... I don't know why they kidnapped Momo. Oh, 
Wanyan is quite mad now. Silence. She deserved to die. She left us with nothing. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. <laughs> what just happened? Did Wanyan just eat the spirit? Can Wanyan kill the spirit? Have you forgotten yourself too? Do you need me to jog your memory as well? Oh my gosh. No, I've seen that form before and I'll never forget it. I'm so sorry. We are sorry. We're called Heck, Gecket, and Froak. Is this one spirit or three? Did he kill the other one? Forgive us. We tried to tell her, oh, her, that stealing a child was taking things too far, but she wouldn't listen. We're going to take the flute. We're going to take Momo. <laughs> We have songs missing baby Momo. I think we ought to take Momo back. Okay, let's take Momo back. And we just need to digest everything that just happened here. So we know the person who lived in our house died. We don't know what from, but the spirit started to feel abandoned. That's when the bathhouse closed. And I think Wanyan just killed a spirit. If we look in our pamphlet, that spirit we did just catch is only one spirit, even though they had three names. And I think the spirit Wanyan dismissed, the female, is gone. Gone, gone. <laughs> Honestly, if it wasn't for finding Bruce, it would have taken me a long time to get that flute. Okay, here you go, song. Reunited. My Momo, you found him. <laughs> Oh, where did you find him? He was spirited away. Okay, you know that is a play on words from the movie Spirited Away, right? It certainly seems like he was. I could believe it too, considering this town's history. Thank you so very much, Bunny. Please accept this as a token of my deepest gratitude. I'm sorry it's not much. It's all I've got, and I won't take no for an answer. Oh, what are we getting? Is she giving us Momo? <laughs> oh, I got some reward money. We have 25, 527. Oh my gosh. <gasps> that was 30,000 moologs. 30,000. Holy smokes. I'll never forget what you've done for me. Aw. And look at Clarence over there just eating a banana. They're all just chilling, like nothing's happening. <laughs> Could you take my mom, Amelia, out for some fresh air when you and she both have some spare time? I feel like some hiking and mountain air would do her good. I'd really appreciate it if you could. We have found Momo and we need to take Amelia out on a hike as part of her spirit quest. Another thing we could do is go and find Tifa. And see if we can... Oh, gosh! <laughs> oh, gosh! <laughs> that scared me. <laughs> well, the only thing I have is a shovel. Or a bug net. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Amelia, no. I need the boar, but I also need to take Amelia hiking. <laughs> no, come on, let's go. Oh, there's the pig. All right. There is too much going on right now. I need to take Amelia for a walk while she's available. I'm thinking that pig will be there later. I don't know what to do with the pig. Let's go for a walk. All right. Oh no, Amelia. Amelia, we're gonna have to go in here. Let's just dip in here for a second until the heat's off us. The bacon. Oh my gosh. What are we supposed to do with the pig? Oh, here. I think we're close. Sorry, Bunny. I know I sound ridiculous. Excited. I know this place. I think she was looking for her friends, right? Childhood friends? She must want to go up north here, right? 
to the lookout area. Up here. How about this, Amelia? Is this it? Yes. Don't jump. Oh, it's a spirit. The sky. That's where I belong. Oh no, Amelia, what? My brethren, I can see them scattered amongst the clouds. Does she mean her dead friends? As I suspected, Amelia isn't losing her marbles. She's possessed. <laughs> We've got to do something to help. The spirit seems to be trying to unpossess Amelia, but it's having trouble. What if you just whack it with a pan, Wanyan? <laughs> I've got an idea. It just might work. See if you can find a stick lying around here. Oh, wait, I see a stick. That will have to do. Now, I'll use my powers to make the stick into a spirit stick. Are we going to smack the spirit? <laughs> there. There. Now, if you swing it, it should pass right through Amelia and knock the spirit out of her. Go give that spirit a whack with B. All right, let's go whack it. We're going to whack this spirit like nobody's business. Okay, here it comes. It's like a piñata. I don't know how much whacking I have to do before it's done. Nothing's happening. Oh! I guess my spell didn't work exactly as I thought. Yeah, I thought it was supposed to pass through Amelia. Did we kill Amelia? <laughs> this game, sometimes it's just too much. It's so funny. I'm free? What was I doing? I'm a little more concerned about Amelia right now. Is she just knocked out? See, it did work. Who? Spirit number two for the day. This is a bit of a disaster. Wait, why does this spirit look like a boar? And yet, we have to go and catch a boar. I'm a little confused. My mind is clearing up like a beautiful sky after a thunder shower. My name is Nimbors. Oh, we have a little boar spirit. What happened here? Well, I think we killed Amelia. This may have been a homicide. You guys saw nothing. Okay? Let's just roll her off the cliff. We'll have to tell Song a story, but we can think of something. We can corroborate. <laughs> uh, okay, Nimbors. You're welcome. You owe us. So, you take care of this. Oh, and the bathhouse is open again. Come on, Bunny. Let's get away from this crime. Right? Wanyan? Wanyan knows. Wang Yan has clearly experienced situations like this before. <laughs> Let's get off this mountain. Okay, I'm with you. Seriously, what the heck? I mean, I want to get away from here, but at the same time, I'm kind of curious. Can we do anything? Amelia seems to be busy. Yeah, um, I don't think she's busy. <laughs> oh my gosh. Wait a minute, can we pause for a thumbnail picture? What a peaceful scene. I mean, there are worse places to go, am I right? This is a very beautiful area for her last moments. But I think we're gonna have to leave her. Oh no, we're gonna have to get rid of her too. Tara, no! If Tara sees Amelia, we're gonna have to take care of Tara too. The body count is going to be climbing here. No, 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 Tara, no! <laughs> Hey, new kid, what's the word? Tara. Okay. Do we take Tara hot springing so she won't see Amelia? Or do we let her go up there and see what happens? Okay. For science, we're going to let Tara discover Amelia and see if the game has any funny things in store for us. Okay. She just walked right on top of her. <laughs> Maybe we're safe. We're just gonna run. So let's go back down to where Tifa works in the tea fields. 
Maybe should we try to catch the boar with a net? Where's the boar? I'm ready. <gasps> Stay away from my mushrooms. Did we just get shanked by the boar? That must have hurt. That baby boar sure is heated. Maybe you can calm it down if you can manage to catch it somehow. Yeah, so how do I catch it? I'm wondering if we're going to see the boar again. Oh, but here's something we can do. Maybe this will provoke the boar to reappear. Do you see this mushroom right here? These mushrooms up here, these are decorative. You can't pick them up, but these, watch. Put them in her backpack. Yolk cap. Those are the mushrooms that we're not supposed to pick, but of course you're supposed to pick them. Okay, he's up there. We're gonna try with the net again. Did we get it? Yes! Oh, it's a little mushroom cat. I don't know what it is. Oh, yeah, it's a cat. You're a cat too? I'm a mushroom cat. Yes, I'm Meow Shroom. Oh my goodness. This could be my new favorite spirit. I still like the spirit that made me naked. Umakiki, I think it is. But this one is super cute. Meow Shroom. Well, which is it? A cat or a mushroom? Well, why can't it be both? I could ask the same to you. Are you a cat or a hippo? <laughs> Why don't you let me sit on your lap and we'll find out. Wait, what? <laughs> Why were you a boar? A boar? Oh, I, I'm afraid I lost myself for quite some time. I'm embarrassed how backwards my mental state must have been. I'm a spirit responsible for helping plants grow. With mushrooms being some of my favorite little guys, I guess. Becoming lost must have twisted my role into something more defensive. Okay, we have found three spirits. That is way more than I anticipated finding in such a short time. Do we dare go and talk to Song and tell her what happened to her mom? Is her mom still up there? Oh, no, she's not. That's Faye. Where is Amelia? Is she dead? Wait, she's alive? A fine night to you, Bunny. Were you needing something? Um, an explanation? I guess you're okay. <laughs> We're just not going to question it. We're just going to go with it. I feel like the game had a fun opportunity that it missed with how Amelia reappears or Amelia's death. But I'm glad she's okay. This train painting. I don't think I've ever seen it before. I'm thinking this is going to be important. Even though it's a thousand moologs, we have a lot now. We're going to buy it. Let's talk with Ling. Gail's the gal who gets my gab. While Ling is here, let me show you where I saw the skeleton. That is what I want to do. It was down here when I saw it. It's gone. The skeleton model from the nurse's room is missing. Song saw a very thin figure walk by the shop around midnight. Julian saw the skeleton model by the western bus stop. Yes, this is where I saw it, but I don't remember what time of day it was. Okay, it's midnight. We are running low on spirit tea because of all of the spirits from today. We're going to lose our spirit vision. Oh no. I should have had some more tea. It is now 8 a.m. Let's double check the spirit board. So, Amelia, we haven't finished her quest. We what? Amelia, what do we need to finish here? I don't know how to complete her quest. Roasted chestnuts in the fall. Oh, it's the first day of fall. I didn't even notice. I was totally oblivious. <laughs> Wait a minute. Let's go out and take a look. I didn't even notice. It is changing colors. Look, the grass is not green anymore. 
Look at the trees. Hey, Tifa. Tifa, we need some more tea. You ate too much. I have that problem all the time. We are going to buy some tea leaves. Yes. A walking stick. That is a new bug. Wait a minute. Ling. You found my missing Mr. Marrow? <laughs> That's the skeleton's name. Get it? Bone Marrow? <sighs> Wait. I didn't find it. He's where? Okay, I'll be right back. Thanks for finding Barry Sneaky Bones for me, Bunny. I genuinely need to use it in presentations at school, and something tells me the kids wouldn't be impressed with my crappy stick figure drawings. So, when I saw the skeleton by the bus stop that one night, it must have counted. Maybe that's why we couldn't find the figure last night? Where is Ling's office? There we go. So her skeleton is back. Ah, that is a mystery. But where is the spirit? Maybe we still need to find this shadowy spirit figure outside of the store. I tried setting up a camera in the nurse's office to see who keeps taking Tommy Tibia. She has so many names for this guy. This is funny. But somehow without fail, the footage is always scrambled when the model skeleton is taken. Mm. So either this is an incredible coincidence or someone is walking around with a portable EMP or something. Thanks to you, we've got Sergeant Skellington back in the nurse's office, but for how long? Who knows? Ah, so we are not done with this. You know what? Here is a Sakura Blossom. We're going to grab that. Oh, we just found some more seeds. Let's go and plant these. And we're going to go check on our other seeds in the bathhouse. We're going to plant the seeds right here, and then we're going to water everything. That one just grew. I'm wondering if at least one of these plants is going to be something we need for the spirit shrines. I did buy some more towels. Let's see how big we can make the stack. And this isn't even all of them. I think there were four left in the washroom. Let's see how tall this is. Holy moly. <laughs> that is a lot of towels. We are going to take the first spirits of the day to the new area. Yes, there's a new area. We have opened not only the right wing here, but we have one outdoor bath. This one right here. Now the right one, I still have to do this one, but this one is open and you don't have to heat it. It's a hot spring, so it's naturally heated by the earth apparently. And I was told that number one, the spirits will stay longer here, but they pay you more and they do. I've made so much money through this bath. And secondly, there are supposedly monkeys. Monkeys that go in that bath and you have to chase them away. I have not seen them yet. I've seen other people have monkeys in their tub. Oh, sorry. I've been doing too much talking. So sorry. But since they stay longer, I'm only going to put them in here at the beginning of the bathhouse time. I'm thinking that maybe the monkeys don't come until you have this other hot spring open, maybe? I also have heard through a wonderful viewer that once you open this left wing and the left wing bath, things get a bit hairy because that apparently is the Lord's bath. And when the Lords arrive, they expect all sorts of pampering, you have to cook food for them. And honestly, I'm not sure I want that. I am very happy with this very chill atmosphere, just seating people. So I am in absolutely no hurry to open the left wing in the Lord's bath. <laughs> no thanks. I like simple. We are going to have to go ahead and close it here at 1130 because I want to be able to go to Song Store and hopefully catch a glimpse of the Skeleton Thief. It's 1212. Nothing. Nothing is happening. We're clearly doing something wrong. 
No, I see nothing up here. Western bus stop. Well, sadly, I think we're just going to have to wait on this spirit. I mean, I don't want to get greedy. We've found quite a few spirits. I saw that lightning bug down here and I got excited. I thought maybe that was a clue, but I don't think so. Hey, I'm happy. We've saved Momo. We captured that spirit. Wanyan, I think, committed a murder there. I think we witnessed that. We have saved Tifa from her boar spirit, which turned out to be a cat mushroom. And we thought we killed Amelia. <laughs> but we saved her from whatever spirit was possessing her. The boar spirit, that's right. So, I think we've done a lot. We have progressed our bathhouse. We have a ton of money from our friend Song. And we have enough to buy the bike, which we will try to do next episode, along with solving the skeleton mystery. And we still have to find Lee painting and solve that spirit. We have, let's count our spirits left. We have 14 spirits left to find. And I am very excited to continue doing so. If you like cute and cozy games, please consider subscribing. And if you want to be extra nice, please drop a like and leave me a comment down below. I enjoy reading everything that you guys comment and I thank you for watching.